Hey guys, what's going on? Garrett Francis here. Uh, I'm just going to shoot you guys a quick video because I've been getting this question very often lately. What is it you do to make money online? Uh, it's become more and more common, so I figured I'd just clear things up for everybody right now. But first, I'm going to tell you about, about my story and kind of what made me do this transition in the first place. So you're going to have to hang tight because I'll tell you and explain that at the end of the video what exactly it is that I do. Um, so I'll make it short and sweet, don't worry. I'm just kind of going to tell you what my, my journey was like, I guess. So um, my online journey started about 21 months ago or so. And, uh, you know, I, I, when I started out, I thought it was going to be a little easier than it actually was, I'll be honest. And uh, uh, a lot of people have that common mis misconception that it's, it's easy or you don't need to put in the effort or it's, they treat it like it's not, a, uh, it's not a natural business and they just kind of think they can sit back and, uh, and coast. But um, I found out the hard way that's not the case at all. Um, I kind of started out and, and uh, like I said, I put in basically the bare minimum. Um, I, did, I did the bare minimum. I didn't put in all the effort I could by any means. And I just kind of coasted. I was making a bit of money, but nothing substantial. Nothing that was going to get me out of the oil field, which was my, my end goal. Um, and I did that for about six months. And uh, it got to the point where uh, we were about to enter another winter. And if any of you guys you know, know what an Alberta winter is like in Canada, it's, it's not fun, especially if you work outside. Uh, so I was about to enter another winter and I was up in camp and I was laying in my bed, in my camp bed, and it was just kind of, I was sitting there, it was snowing outside, it was miserable, and uh, it was the weekend, and my friends had been snowboarding, and I was away from my girlfriend again, and um, you know, I was just laying there and I was depressed, and I was like, I can't do this again, I can't do this for one more year, There's there's got to be another way. Uh, there's got to be something else I can do that doesn't involve being away all the time, being up in camp, working outside every winter. And, um, you know, little did I know that the, the way I was looking for, my, my escape I was looking for was something that I had already got started with, right? And, um, and I really started to dig deep and I looked at some of the people who were having success online already, some people I was in contact with. And, uh, you know, I realized that the difference, what separated me from them is what they were putting their effort in and they were treating like this, treating this like a business and they were treating this, you know, like, like it was do or die. Like there was no other option but succeeding. And, uh, you know, I, I made that conscious decision right then and there. In the morning, I woke up with a mindset shift. I started listening to my mentors. I started doing the training. Um, you know, I started reading the books, which is something I had never done. And uh, about two months after that, I had my first month where I replaced my oil field income. And uh, that was kind of my rule before I left the oil field. I had to make the same amount of money I was making in the oil field because let's be honest, I had bills, mortgage payments. Um, you know, I couldn't just drop everything and go make no money. So um, I left the oil field on December 20th of 2016 and I haven't worked in the oil field since. So that was kind of my, my mindset shift and um, you know, it was just one decision I, I made and I decided, you know, I have to do something else because I'm sick of doing this and I'm the only one who can make the change. I'm fully responsible for the situation I'm in. So I just did it. I just made the, I just made the change and, and uh, I'm so grateful that I did. Um, so I hope that inspires some people, maybe not, but uh, if you can relate, I'm sure, um, <clears throat> I'm sure that meant something to you. But uh, now I'll get to the good part you guys are probably waiting for. What is it I do online? Uh, it's called affiliate marketing and it's becoming more and more common nowadays. A lot of companies like GoPro, Amazon, big companies are starting to do this. And uh, basically all it means is you're affiliated with a company, you promote their products or services. Uh, when your efforts lead to the sale, you get paid commission. Uh, so if that's confusing to anybody, uh, it's kind of like, let's say your buddy has his Harley for sale and he says, look Garrett, I don't have time to sell my Harley. Do you mind selling it for me? If you sell it, I'll give you a chunk of the sales, right? And uh, you say, yeah, for sure, I'll do what it takes. So you do what it takes to sell him, to sell his Harley for him. And then once you sell his Harley, he's like, great, for your effort, your time and effort, Garrett, I'm gonna give you a percentage of whatever I sold the Harley for. And you know, it's as simple as that. It's a simple concept, but it works really well. I mean, it's, it's been my vehicle to get out of my current situation that I was in. And um, yeah, so that's basically it. I hope I answered some questions. If you guys still have questions, there is a live masterclass. We have them every Monday and Thursday. Uh, super informative, really powerful. That's kind of where I started as well. 
It's free, so you can get uh, a ton of info, make an informed decision, and um, go from there. So if you guys are interested in that, just comment below, comment, learn more. I can send you the link, and uh, you can check out the masterclass, save your spot, or you can PM me, and I'll also give you the link, and you can save your spot there and check out that masterclass. So I hope that was in, uh, informative for you guys. I hope I answered some questions, and uh, I look forward to hearing you guys. I hope you tune in to the end. Peace.